Welcome to Soy Dog Scoops and today I'm going to take you behind the scenes and into our cat hospital where you'll get to see our new cat ultrasound machine in action. Okay so we're going to go in now and uh, meet Dr Hope, um, the cat hospital manager who's going to carry out the ultrasound on one of our patients called Ed Sheeran. So Ed was brought in um, around three weeks ago after suffering a road traffic accident. The time he was brought in, he'd had head trauma, which had caused temporary blindness. He was bleeding profusely from the nose and the mouth and also had a lung contusion. So today, after three weeks of treatment, he's still here, but we want to re-ultrasound just to find out how he's going. So, Dr. Hope, can I ask, what are you looking yes. for? What are you looking for when you're doing the ultrasound now? Now, uh, we are checking if any damage to the internal organs. Okay. Yes, because uh, before the cat got lung contusion and heat luxation, so it, and also head injury, so our uh, body has trauma. The ultrasound machine is a vital piece of equipment. It allows our vets to immediately um, assess and look at any internal damage and to be able to then treat accordingly and also then to be able to monitor their progress as they go through treatment and determine the next steps. So, so really it's invaluable to us here um, and also to aid the recovery of the cats who, who come into us. Ed did come in after being hit by a vehicle and obviously took trauma to the head which did cause temporary blindness. Um, some of that vision has come back but he still has partial um, loss of sight in the left eye so that's what we're just having a look at now to see how permanent that damage can actually be. What does the ultrasound tell us? Oh. Everything is okay now, the okay. cat recover with good lung and no any damage to internal organs and the eye structure is still intact, everything <gasps> okay. So you think over time he's going to be, yeah. Ed's going to be perfectly healthy and... Yeah, uh, but only uh, the blood results, that's still mm -hmm. anemia and okay. the heat luxation so we have to monitor again okay. if the blood is ready to do the surgery but it's, if it's too long time maybe no need surgery okay it can heal by itself okay but it's all good news yeah hey maybe we'll be able to to find you a home because you're certainly a good boy and you're very cute i'm delighted to bring you yet another happy tale of adoption this time it's gorgeous girl nong tong she arrived at our hospital after she was hit by a car and tragically due to the damage caused, lost her front leg. Quiet and reserved, she spent over four years here at the Jill Dali Sanctuary, until one day she caught the attention of a caring volunteer. As their bond grew, Nong Tong's confidence blossomed, and she's finally found her forever home right here in Phuket. Whether she's chilling on the bed, enjoying an early morning paddle, or digging for crabs on the beach, their story is true testament to the power of adoption and how love can transform lives. Often, shy animals like Nong Tong are often overlooked and they need patience and understanding to allow them to grow in confidence. Though allowing them the time and space to adapt, it's wonderful to see just how much happiness a home of their own can provide and how it can transform their lives forever. It truly is such a rewarding experience for both dog and human. To make a difference to a dog's life, and if you're ready to start your own adoption journey, please head over to the Soy Dog website. We also caught up with Joshua and Xenia, the daring duo behind Pedal for Paws. This animal-loving pair are cycling from Germany to Thailand to help raise funds for Soy Dog's CMVR program. Last month saw them cross the border from Tajikistan to 
Kyrgyzstan. And during a brief rest break, they accidentally crushed a Kyrgyz wedding. After enjoying a spot of local hospitality, it was back to the road where they braved mile high elevations and freezing cold temperatures. But thankfully, they made a few friends along the way. As they continue their journey through the mountains of China, they are drawing ever closer to reaching the Jill Dali Sanctuary in 2025. This year has been packed full of soy dog love stories, from chance encounters to pre-wedding photo shoots. And now it's spread even further with a surprise proposal. Visitors Dilip and Elva joined us for a tour of the sanctuary. And after taking a break by the side of our lake and with the help of one of our residents, Prarung, Dilip popped the question. And of course, Elva said yes. After all, who could resist a proposal when one of our gorgeous four-legged dogs is involved? The name Prowrung translates to shiny rainbow and this little lady certainly brought some sparkle, along with the ring, to a very special moment. And finally, did you know that the Jill Dali Sanctuary is set within 12 acres of lush green space and is kept in immaculate condition by our team of three hard-working gardeners? Led by head gardener Bao, this fantastic trio maintain a vast area. Working in a tropical climate with the extreme heat and monsoon rain is certainly no mean feat, though you can see the incredible transformation that this team have made to the sanctuary. And thanks to them, everyone, including our resident dogs, can enjoy acres of stunning outdoor space. I hope you enjoyed watching and please follow us on all our social media channels to stay tuned to all the behind the scenes work that goes on at Soy Dog Foundation. Thank you.